Let me now go into the purpose of financial ratios. The financial ratios are essential tools for interpreting financial statements. They provide a quantitative way to evaluate a company's performance, the financial stability and efficiency. And the main purpose of financial ratios, I shall dwell more on that as we move on. The first purpose of financial ratio is performance evaluation. What do I mean by performance evaluation? In assessing a company's profitability, the, in assessing their efficiency and effectiveness, and performance evaluation in this instance, it helps in utilizing the resources that are being gathered in the organization or a company. The second purpose is comparative analysis. Com comparing a company's performance with industry benchmark or competitors to identify strengths and weakness. With comparative analysis, it assists a company to prepare the strengths and weakness of their organizations. The third point is risk analysis. What risk analysis point is talking about is it helps to determine a company's financial level of risk, including its ability to meet the short-term and long-term obligations of the business. The fourth point is the efficiency analysis. As we know, the efficiency analysis in this instance, uh, the ratio helps to measure the how efficiently a company utilizes its resources, such as the assets and inventory. Efficiency ratio can identify areas where improvements are kind of needed in order to optimize operations. The fifth purpose is investor decision making. The investors in this instance, they use ratios to make informed final investment decision rather. They took, they look for companies with strong financial ratios that indicate stability and growth potential. The sixth purpose is um, credit analysis. Creditors and lenders, they use ratios to evaluate a company's credit worthiness. That's this, all this I'm talking about are the importance of, uh, I mean, the purpose of financial ratio. The strong ratios can enhance a company's ability in order to secure loans of favorable credit terms. So the seventh point is the management tool. Ratios, in this instance, they serve as a valuable tool for management in order to monitor and evaluate the company's financial performance. The reason for this is that um, they can guide decision making, they can guide budgeting, they can also guide strategic, uh, strategic planning. And to that, we go to the eighth point which talks about communication. In communication, companies use ratios to communicate their financial health to their shareholders, or also their stakeholders in the same vein. And regulatory authorities through financial statements and annual reports. That's about that.